hello hello welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi i'm gabby i'm a new york city based life and style content creator i'm also a full-time phd student living in new york city and today we are doing a fun little video it's very quick because i had technical difficulties with the video i was going to film for today but that's okay that's all right we adapt we keep moving so we're gonna do my five to nine after my nine to five video so basically like a summer night routine evening routine it's august 14th which is my birthday one of the things i'm treating myself to is takeout i got thai food which is one of my favorite things to get if i wasn't doing takeout i usually would cook when i get home i needed to get steps in because i felt very like sluggish and lacking energy so i went on a little walk through central park usually i would cook when i get home from work or heat up leftovers or whatever spring rolls because they're my favorite I get thai iced tea which is also my favorite chicken patsy and if you live on the upper east side i get tap thai but i'm going to eat dinner my mom told me about this show called from which i think is on mgm plus we have it through prime um no i think we have it through i don't actually know why i have this oh Thai iced tea always slaps. Anyway, I'm watching From. It's very creepy and weird, um, and I'm obsessed. It's about this town where like people who are like travelers will just randomly end up being like taken to this town, and um, they can't like leave it. And there are like monsters that come out at night. It's fascinating. I am so locked in. It's so, it's so my kind of show. I'm just very excited that my mother mentioned it to me because it is so good so far. I'm gonna watch an episode of that while I eat and then we'll circle back with the rest of my night routine. That is the vibe, that's what we're doing. I had a cutie little birthday dinner and drinks and apps and things yesterday with book club girlies who I adore um, and they got me the most delicious cake and it's literally from Whole Foods. Um, but it's so good so I have some leftover of that I'm gonna have and yeah it was just 28 like i feel so much more aligned with like myself like i feel like i know what i liked i liked that i got to hang out with my friends tomorrow i like that i'm going to virginia to visit my parents and hang out with my parents this weekend i like that today is like a solo day that i can just journal and go on my central park walk just kind of have time to myself to like just reflect and make intentions for the for like the next year of life like i don't know just feel i feel very like in tune with like what i want to be doing so love that but yeah i'm gonna eat my food before it gets cold but doesn't it look delicious and i will circle back cool <laughs> every single night so that the mini twists last longer okay teeth are cleaned today i'm going to do the loops weekly reset rejuvenating face mask i'm a big fan of loops actually and they sell them at ulta and cbs now so they're easy to get, which is nice. And I like these because they come in two pieces. I think actually most face masks at this point come in two pieces. So maybe that's not revolutionary, but I feel like Loops was one of the first to do it. I could be wrong, but I think that's true. And so there's like the eye piece. And I like to do face masks on Sunday and Wednesday. 
in general just to give the skin a little pick-me-up oh that, that feels impeccable i think the first time i did this i did this wrong but there's like a texture side to it that's supposed to go on your skin easy peasy lemon squeezy leave that on for 10 minutes Ooh, that feels so nice i love face masks i love really any opportunity to like pamper that's my vibe last year my mom and i did like a spa day that was real goaded of us all right 10 minutes let's do it Face mask is cooking. I'm gonna make my birthday journal spread, but very exciting. I like could not find my journal that I've been writing in for years and years. Then I found another moleskin that I just guess I forgot about, but it's a thin one. And I feel like this might be cute to just start like a new year, like a 28, year 28 notebook. I feel like I couldn't find my other journal for a reason because then I found this. Open this guy up. I really like the moleskins because I really like um, this is literally just like the classic collection moleskin um, and it's a dotted one. <laughs> this one just has dotted pages in it and I think this would be nice just to use throughout the year. Um, I really like the moleskins because I like that they're soft cover. I don't know. I feel like just nice and then i can put like mementos and stuff in here what do we think what do we think i'm gonna go through my pinterest board and find prompts that i'll put on the screen here and then i'm gonna do my entry for the day and then i kind of want to finish carrie soto i don't know if i'll be able to do it all tonight but i'm very close to being done and i'm like kind of at the part where i'm like flipping through pages very quickly um because i need to know what happens is carrie soto back does she win i need to know i need to know so thanks to fran for lending this to me because i'm actually really enjoying it that is the agenda we've got our reading and we've got our journal and i think that is 28 we're demure okay we're mindful we're cutesy a cute little night in not doing too much you know I'm gonna have my iPad here, it's charging, but I'm gonna go through my Pinterest board and find prompts. Exciting things are happening. I've got my candle going here. It is a pros candle and it smells delicious. And I I fear I'm gonna have to buy another one. And I looked it up and it's kind of expensive, so help. Um, but it smells so good and it's so relaxing. Like it just puts me in such a calm place. I think I've talked about this in i think maybe my 5 a.m morning routine but at night at like 8 30 my evening playlist plays and it's a mixture of like jazz some old school music some just like calm nighttime pop you know just very like chill music a lot of like hosier maggie rogers beyonce's cowboy carter like the first half of cowboy carter um, some Taylor Swift, some Adele, like Adele 30. Um, I'll link it down below. It's just it's a public Spotify playlist. I really, really like it. It's so calming. That plays at 8.30. I also have my Echo Dot that will tell me to do like a 10 minute clean. That's usually when I put the dishes in the dishwasher, clean anything in the sink. Um, just kind of tidy up the apartment to like pick stuff up off my coffee table. My goal really with my apartment is to keep it in like just like a basally clean or tidy state. And this was heightened when carbon monoxide alarm went off a couple weeks ago or maybe a week ago because the way that like when, when your carbon monoxide alarm goes off, you have to call 911 so that the fire department comes. And the way that I was so 
thankful that my apartment was in a state that like was not chaotic like it was quite tidy in here and like literally the only thing in the way were like my books so like they're like these you know burly men coming in with all their gear and stuff and usually i have shit everywhere and somehow my apartment was actually in like tidiness i like literally just cleaned my apartment and i was like oh yeah so i have to keep this like tidy all the time because what if something like that happens again why you know Ooh. but anyway that whole thing got me thinking and i was like it's really good that i have a system in place that i use to help me stay keep it tidy regularly throughout the week um so i definitely recommend having like a little reminder that's like hey girl clean up because it does help and i actually do go and clean up and tidy up a little bit but yeah okay let's take this face mask off and we'll get going with our goals and intentions and um reflections this year was such 27 was such a fun year it was a reset year it's a shifting priorities it was assessing interpersonal relationships it was just kind of a clearing out of things that didn't serve me and for that i'm thankful to 27 but i am so ready for 28 i like you know leading up to my birthday i was kind of like uh, 28 whatever um but then today i was like i feel so sure of myself confident in myself like knowing what i need to do knowing like what works for me and something about that just feels really powerful yeah i'm feeling good but yeah let's take this off Ooh. Ooh, it's bright. Then I'm gonna use the Laneige Water Bank moisturizer to kind of lock in all that goodness that we got from the mask. I really like this. I'm almost out of it actually, so that's nice. Also have some Naturium under eye cream because your girl's getting old apparently. I look exactly like my mom, which means I will look 30 for a majority of my life, which is nice. But we still want to take care of our skin, so. Amazing skin looks. Fabulous! Hello, hello. I am headed to sleep. I actually did end up finishing Carrie Soto is back. I really liked it. I really liked it. I thought I was gonna, I, I could feel myself kind of tearing up a little bit. I don't know, it like got sad at the end. I was like, oh. Solid book from Taylor Jenkins Reid. Probably like 3.5 stars. Also like, I just want to say, like my rating scale has definitely changed over time i think i used to think like three stars was like a bad rating to give but like genuinely like three stars like that's solid to me that's like a it's like a good read you know like it's not life changing maybe but like i enjoyed it i had a good time you know like it was it was good to me you know so like three stars that's solid in my book um so 3.5 you know solid showing okay gotta pick the next read i think i might i think i might start either piglet or the guest maybe but anyway let me stop rambling because i'm real tired and i want to go to sleep
so yeah but that was my evening routine my evening routine looks more or less like that every night some nights i also edit but i didn't do that tonight but yeah that's the vibe if you made it this far to the video make sure that you hit that subscribe button um i post every sunday or i try to yeah be sure to follow me on social insta tiktok pinterest you know the vibes i hope that you enjoyed this video i will see you next week bye